Amanda, do you want to hear about my um, dream that I had last night? I had two funny dreams. Yeah, let's hear them. Okay, so the first one, I was um, in the gym and I was walking, doing walking lunges with a 100 pound barbell. <laughs> Strong AF. I don't even weigh 100 pounds. What's the other one? Um, my second dream was that I was in high school and I was like, you know, when you get like sick in high school and you go to the nurse. And I went to the nurse and she told me the only cure for my sickness was to do cocaine and I wouldn't do it. Oh, <laughs> you're a good little middle schooler. <laughs> what? That's funny. What does the mean? guys good morning it is about 9 in the morning on Tuesday November 15th All right, so this is bite meals it comes with egg whites some chicken bacon and some pancakes so the macros for this meal are gonna be like I think it's five fat seven, 14 grams of carbs and then 27 grams of protein total it also comes with a little syrup So instead of taking an entire tub, I showed you guys when I was traveling and packing and stuff, instead of taking an entire tub of aminos or protein or whatever, I bring everything in a baggie. So I'm having some PE Science aminos, strawberry breeze flavor. I'm gonna put some in my shaker cup for the day. So I have my aminos and then I also mix um, some creatine in here as well. I put the creatine inside the bag. So it's all mixed up together and it's probably just enough for me to like have for the next few days because I do take creatine every single day. I take five milligrams or three to five milligrams of creatine. If you're a girl, you can probably go on the three milligram side, but just take it every single day. It helps with your strength gains. It helps within the gym. So just, just take it. Don't worry about a loading phase. Don't worry about bloating. None of that. Just don't worry about it. Just take it. All right, it is about 1.30 in the afternoon. Let's cut to LA Fitness. I have some squats to do today, and I think I have some upper body stuff as well. Squats are gonna be sets of 11 today, so my coach actually changed my program slightly by just doing sets of five and 11 instead of six and 12, and then I'm gonna be upping the weight. So I'm gonna try for 130 pounds today, sets of 11. Got my PE Science High Volume, and this is a pump product. I'm not really using it to be stronger or to give me energy, but I am gonna do some arms later. And I love this stuff. It just tastes really freaking good too. So we're gonna go ahead and put some knee sleeves on. Um, I don't necessarily need them to do my sets of 11 because they're not super heavy, but I like wearing them. They do help a little bit. I'm gonna show you guys how I put them on. I know that I've gotten a lot of questions about that. So these are, they say right and left, so you can figure that out for yourself. I don't feel like traveling with them and sometimes having an extra pair of shoes in your bag just like makes everything heavier so I haven't been bringing them. They do help if you have poor ankle mobility so that just means if you can't keep your back upright and the bar in a straight path all the way up and all the way down that might mean that your ankle mobility is poor so that means that having a bit of a heel helps you get in the right position to squat the proper and safe position to squat but I have decent ankle mobility and I can go up and down straight without even having a heel so just having a flat shoe works just fine for me it's all personal um, there's not one thing better than another it just all depends on you and how your body moves and how your body works all right so now I'm here doing the hamstring curl machine I haven't started yet but I did want to also talk about wrist straps this is a power wrap from Slingshot. Um, Barbell Brigade sells these, bodybuilding.com sells these. You can get them any uh, sports store around you, probably like a sports chalet or like a Dick's probably has these as well. Essentially, you just take it, wrap it around your thumb as to where it goes this way and like down around you. And then you'll take it from the top and you'll just wrap it around until you get a good grip on it. 
and then what I do is I pull it as tight as possible. It's hard to show you like this. Pull it tight and then wrap it around like this. And it's, it's supposed to kind of hurt as well. And then it protects your wrists. Cause when I'm low bar squatting guys, I have the bar way over here, okay? It's like way under here. And to hold it, I have to push my wrist back like this and, and you have a heavy load on your back and you're squeezing the bar as hard as possible and your wrist is like way back here. Your uh, middle back mobility, uh, like you have to be able to stretch that as much as you can in order to keep everything really tight and compact like right around here and then your wrist just gets pushed back really far so like your wrist mobility comes into play and then sometimes it just kind of hurts so uh, these help. Problems when I don't have a tripod, I have nowhere to put my camera to show you guys this exercise. <laughs> this is so stupid. Slipping away through my fingers. I'm on display to show my inner. Now I'm searching for something new. My heart is burning for someone like you. I'm not gonna be the last one. I'm not gonna lose control. You just need to be the right one, and I can't deal with this no more. Might be a good spot. Potentially a decent spot. That's a little bit better when you don't have a tripod problem. I just wanted to explain a little bit to you guys about sponsorships. I have a new sponsor coming in the mail today. Um, I have been working with Icon Meals for the last like six to eight months or so and Icon Meals has been absolutely amazing and before you guys say like you're a sellout, you're yada 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 for switching companies or whatever, um, I just want to preface this with a, I just want to explain to you guys that uh, this has absolutely nothing to do with me not liking Icon Meals, me getting more money from this other company, me like selling out or whatever, that literally makes no sense and if you guys don't understand things about sponsorships, YouTube, um, things like that, give the video a like because I have a lot to say about this topic and I will do a video on it explaining everything about sponsorships. Um, mine included and why YouTubers have them and like how we create an income from it. If this video gets to like 5,000 likes or so, I don't know if that's overreaching or not, but if it gets to that then I'll make a video on it. So otherwise I'm not sure if you guys are even interested in that, so if you are, please give the video a thumbs up and let me know because I will do that for you. I've been working with Icon Meals and I recently decided to switch meal prep companies just because the meal prep company that I'm getting in the mail today is just more, it just fits me better as a person. So Icon Meals is great and they have great products, they have great people behind them. The athlete manager is wonderful, the owner is wonderful, the food is really, really good. I use it all the time and I was using it all the time, however, there was a lot of uh, food choices that or meal options that didn't necessarily fit my macros as well as this other meal prep company just because it's a little bit more catered towards females so um, that's why I decided to switch personally it was just a better fit for me I can like choose the fun ones and stuff instead of just ordering like the bulk meats like I was doing with Icon and like again they're great and I'm not switching for any monetary reason I'm just switching because it's a better fit for me personally and regardless I'm excited to share it with you guys I hope you guys understand but um, I'm getting those in the meal t mail today and I think that they're supposed to come this morning I'm not totally positive they're supposed to come today and I would like them to come now because I want breakfast but if not I'll just make regular breakfast so um, again that sponsorship video, I will do it if the video gets enough likes. Yeah, let's get the day started. Is it? Hi. Oh, it's my clothes. Yeah. It's probably both of our stuff. Yay! Yay! Know that you're like a married couple when the meal prep company sends both your meals in the same box. Okay. Say hi to me. Oh, so Karen and I, Karen and I are both now sponsored by Bite Meals and we're really excited to open our yeah. first, it's not our first box, we got a box at uh, our house in LA but I didn't film or anything yet, I just wanted to make sure I liked all the food and I definitely do so I'm excited to show you guys what we got. You're excited. My lunch 
Let's see what's in the box. It doesn't matter. This it's one is two pairs of eggs with bacon and eggs. Ooh, that sounds good. Those are my, that's my the favorite. The macros on this are phenomenal. Wait. Five grams of fat, only 14 carb, and you get two pancakes. So and it's 27 seven protein. for each pancake? That's seven carb amazing. for each pancake. What? And they're really good. These are magical pancakes. <laughs> we blondie. Each of the cookies have different macros, but they're all like super macro friendly. So like um, one of them is only seven fat, 12 carb, like amazing macros. Look how good this one is. They have a bunch of seasonal meals for uh, Thanksgiving right now. This one is ham with stuffing and Sorry, seasonal is that veggies. Pineapple in there? Yes. Okay. It's only six fat, only 34 carb for the entire meal, and there's a bunch of stuffing and pineapple, mm -hmm. and 29 protein. Look how good that looks. What? It's crazy good. Six fat, 34 carb, and 29 protein. I love, I love how they come fresh, too. Yeah, it's like next day priority shipping. Nothing is frozen. I'm aware of how silly this topic is to discuss, but in reality, it's not that silly. And I did just want to say that this morning, it's been um, well, over a year since I've got my period, and I got it back this morning, so. Time to celebrate. Woo. In all seriousness, it's really hysterical because I was literally talking with my coach the other day who watched my past video and was like, I just watched your video, I wanna strategize in order to get your period back. Um, we were planning on bumping my fats up and just eating more. Um, got it back this morning, so really ironic. Just goes to show that it does take time and it does take eating. So it is currently the next day. This morning we are headed to go on a, a little hike this morning. And um, we have a longer day today, so we wanted to like, get this in in the morning and then just uh, get back and then get ready for the rest of the day. Good morning, welcome to Starbucks. How can I help you? Hi, can I get a venti hot coffee? Venti hot coffee? And can I get a splash of almond milk? Splash of almond. Okay. And then um, four stevia. I was wondering if people still use these things. What things? These things in the middle of the bed. Oh my god, yes. <laughs> But it's the place that we're called it's called Swallow Cliff. Swallow Cliff. So this is just a set of stairs. It's kind of like the Santa Monica stairs. Have you ever done that, Care? I have not. Oh, it's fun. It's really, really fun. <sighs> My mom said this is nothing. I know, she's like, holy shit. I recommend anybody who does this type of Exercise on the reg. Okay, we did it. We officially completed five flights of that awful Whew. stair thing. It wasn't that bad, but it was really steep. So five flights, 125 steps. It's like 625 steps plus on the way down times two. 1250 math. I'm good at that. <laughs> Is that it? Is that right? I don't know. It's just a lot of stuff. I did it. Yeah, that's right. We are currently five minutes away from getting to the Alpha Elite meetup, and we're just joining in with the Alpha Elite crew just because they're already planning a meetup. And not gonna lie, I always want to plan a meetup, but if I'm somewhere traveling and I'm not with like a group or guys or I'm alone, I kind of I kind of just get scared and nervous to do it by myself. So we're just hopping in on their meetup and I'm really excited to meet whoever is coming. I'm not sure how much I'm gonna be able to vlog because I like just interacting face to face, talking with people and not pulling out my camera and you know, so. All right, try them. Carbon up. Chicken, <laughs> chicken and up. Yeah, okay. Hey everybody. That meetup was absolutely insane. I didn't get to vlog anything for the meetup, but it was absolutely insane. You guys were super nice. I love meeting everybody in Chicago. I absolutely love the city, and I will 100% be back here. Like, I love it here. I love the people here. I love the atmosphere. It's amazing. It is our last night in Chicago. Karen, Alexa, and I are with them right now. Say hi. 
Oh, you look so cute. My entire outfit is from Forever 21. I have a bodysuit, a red skirt, and then these new boots that I'm absolutely obsessed with. We're headed to the best restaurant in Chicago according to these lovely ladies that are locals. It's like one of the best restaurants. There's so many good restaurants here, but they've been meaning to take me and they've been meaning to go back and I'm really excited to go. It's called Girl and the Goat. I don't know if you guys have heard of it, but um, I'm not gonna bring my camera just because it's our last night and I wanna like enjoy myself, so I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here and the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. And next time you see a video, I'll be in a different city. So make sure you guys stay tuned and I'll catch you guys in the next one.